also finally spotted a red squirrel and I have never seen so many different types of plants. I've just found my first ever orchid. The view from up here is absolutely amazing. It's our second full day in the Isle of Wight. Yesterday we went to a beautiful wedding, which was so lovely. And now we're here at the garlic farm. Just had a very garlicky lunch. And now we're off to go and see what kind of wildlife we can find. So right now we're in the middle of a beautiful wildflower meadow here at the garlic farm. Um, it's as far as the eye can see, full of wildflowers. And I have to say, I don't know the names of all of them, but there's such variety. I've seen birds with trefoil, I've seen some sort of thistles, daisies, ground ivy, this gorgeous purple plant here, which seems to be everywhere. Um, and it's just wonderful to be here, full of all the sounds and the smells of summer. It's just great. So I have to say, we're probably gonna be here for quite a while looking for insects. nature reserve to try and spot a red squirrel so Chris has just seen one uh, further up the path but unfortunately I was watching a woodpecker so I didn't manage to spot that it's a bit disappointing um, but there's plenty of bird life here I've seen jays I've seen magpies I've seen crows um, as I say I saw the spotted woodpecker we see some grey herons lots of stuff going on um, but I really 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 want to see a red squirrel before the end of today so fingers crossed squirrels unfortunately but we've come down to this kind of meadowy area behind me and there's loads and loads of little bunny rabbits which is so lovely to see they're all gambling around and playing um, so yeah no red squirrels I did see another buzzard which was great uh, we went down to a kind of marshy area which has some great wildflowers as well and uh, we're just gonna go back through the forest area to try and hopefully see a red squirrel I mean we've got some nuts we know where the feeders are so I really do hope one does make an appearance um, yeah and I'll keep you updated so, finally spotted a red squirrel. We've been here for about two hours now. Uh, Chris, there he is there. Uh, he spotted it and I came running along the path to find him. And it was wonderful. It was so much smaller than our grey our gray squirrels um, back in the UK or back in the back in London. Um, I kind of thought this one was a bit of a mix between a grey and a red maybe, because he wasn't as bright red as I thought it was going to be. It was a bit more sort of brownish greyish. Definitely had the little ear tufts though, so I knew for certain that he was red. Uh, and when he ran across and the pathway as he went through the sunlight he definitely shone more orangey red then um, but it's so exciting to see and I'm so happy that we finally saw one I'd always wanted to see one of those uh, and yeah coming to the Isle of Wight I would be really really disappointed if we had to go home without seeing one so yay! So I'm here in the Hyde overlooking this wonderful wetland habitat here at Alveston Nature Reserve and I've just seen a kingfisher after having seen three or four uh, red squirrels playing all around us on top of the hide, running around the trees, taking some nuts from uh, the branches outside which was fantastic. Got some really great footage of them. Uh, unfortunately I didn't get a shot of the kingfisher but that's for another day I suppose later in the summer. Um, but yeah, I've had a fantastic day here and I can't wait to share all my pictures with you. I've just found my first ever orchid. It's an early purple orchid and it's just beautiful. We're looking for butterflies, we're looking for butterflies. 
Wears all morning. I've seen, what have I seen? I've seen a dingy skipper, I've seen um, a Glanville Fritillary, which was beautiful, a Brown Argus, Common Blue, I've seen Adonis Blue just fluttering past, unfortunately didn't get a picture, um, but it's just been wonderful, it's been so good. The weather, as you can see, is absolutely perfect. You can see the others down there, still on the hunt for butterflies. It's a little bit windy, so I'm hoping the wind isn't going to affect the, the audio on this. Um, yeah, but this orchid. It's just topped everything off nicely. It's absolutely beautiful. So that's it everyone. Thank you so much for watching my first ever wildlife video here on the beautiful Isle of Wight. Uh, we're just about to catch the ferry back to Southampton, but I'm so happy. We've seen so many wonderful creatures, including uh, red squirrels, which was fantastic. Um, I'm gonna put all the information in the description box below of the different places that we visited, including Alveston Meads, which is where we saw all the red squirrels, there are at least five. So if you're interested in that, that's the place to go. Um, make sure to follow Quest for Nectar, uh, follow me on Instagram, uh, follow the blog, down down below they'll find a link so you can subscribe to my newsletter um, and also make sure to subscribe to YouTube because I'm sure I'll be uploading some new videos very soon um, but in the meantime thanks for watching bye